Faraday Future. Remember them? They're the automaker founded back in 2014. The goal was to launch their first vehicle, the FF91, back in 2017. Clearly the time has come and gone, but Faraday Future is still here and apparently the FF91 is ready to roll out. The top spec model is called the FF91 2.0 Futurist Alliance, and it carries a price tag as big as its name, $309,000. That's right, I said 309, and that's for the top spec version limited to 300 examples. The next rung down is the 2.0 Futurist and it starts at $249,000. So first, let's back up. What the heck is the FF91? It's a wickedly powerful electric tall sedan with a sleek roof, good range, and impressive acceleration. According to Faraday, the FF91 uses a trio of motors to produce 1,050 horsepower and 1,458 pound-feet of torque. This apparently lets you rip from zero to 60 miles per hour in just 2.27 seconds. Yet the car is also carrying an EPA estimated range of 381 miles via the 142 kilowatt hour battery pack. On the inside, the FF91 is both a car to drive and one to be driven in. The rear seats can recline up to 60 degrees. All of the passengers can watch movies on the massive screens and the driver can enjoy the torque vectoring system. Though I'm going to read the verbatim description of this from the press release so you can get an idea of the buzzword insanity into which we're diving here. The hyper multi-vectoring of FF91 2.0 Futurist and FF91 2.0 Futurist Alliance has a multi-axis design that intelligently adjusts the torque output of each wheel according to different driving conditions to achieve optimal drive force distribution and provide precise and agile handling performance. The system intelligently adjusts torque output, allowing for a personalized AI customized driving experience that delivers ultimate control and handling. The large battery pack and multi-axis no latency hyperpower output not only provide an exciting experience for the driver, but also allow passengers to sit comfortably in the back and enjoy the thrill of the ride. The integration of multi-axis vectoring and AI technology was designed to enable the FF91 2.0 Futurist to keep excellent ride control and safety in different hyper modes, even in emergency situations. Additionally, users can opt for a one-on-one -on -one bespoke private AI and tuning package to further enhance their ultimate driving experience. So why am I including this bit? Well, you see, this car apparently has tons of AI driving tech and it features a bespoke private AI a general AI, and a personalized AI system. This is all part of the Faraday Future AI Hypercar 6x4 Architecture 2.0, which, again, let me read the description of that. 6x4 refers to the vertical integration and horizontal penetration of FF6 technology platforms and four technology systems. The six technology platforms are FF Open App, FF AI OS2, FF AI HW 2.0, FF Mechanical, FF Cloud, and FF AI. The four technology systems are the Magic All-in-One, Hyper Multi-Vectoring, Third AI Space, and FF AI Driving. This feels like someone asked chat GPT to define torque vectoring, drive modes, and then find a way to add Bitcoin grade buzzwords into the mix and boy, did it deliver. On top of all of that, Faraday Future offers a subscription service called AI Hypercar Plus. It's not clear what it does beyond internet for your car and vehicle tuning, maybe. What is clear is the price of that option, which is $14,900 per year, which is the introductory price for the first 2,000 people to sign up. The price of the car is surprising. The price of the subscription service is wild, but the performance numbers are incredibly intriguing and the interior looks like it could be amazing if you're sitting in the back on a long car ride somewhere. Still, instead of tossing down a $5,000 deposit for the Futurist Alliance or $1,500 for the Futurist, then either $309,000 or $249,000, you can just go buy a Lucid Air today.